Hi everyone, my name is Peter Kralski and today I will show you how you can add a loan in our uh, software as a service financial model. We will go step by step and I will show you how you can specify the parameters of the loan. Um, if you enjoy this video, you may give us a like, subscribe our channel. Uh, also, you can order a financial model from scratch. Um, and let's start creating this block of inputs. First of all, we will uh, specify the amount of lo loan, then we will have to specify uh, when we get this loan, year, month, uh, the, the level of interest rate, the grace period for um, uh, principal payments, for interest payments. So let's go through each block of inputs. So this is the color of our inputs. This is uh, the unique color of inputs through all our model. These are the inputs. These are the inputs. Uh, all inputs are marked with the unique color.
So now let's place these uh, inputs into chronology. We have this timeline. First of all, we specify uh, the moment in our timeline when we get the loan. So this is the moment when we get our load. Um, the next uh, moment that we search is the moment. Um, the next uh, moment that we search is the moment when we start uh, payments uh, uh, from uh, interest payments or principal payments. Then we count uh, the loan, the months inside the loan term.
now we will see countdown um, of loan term now we will extract the formula Here we see when our loan ends now it's time to place the payments of the principal and uh, interest uh, payments. So here we see that we have some grace period for um, principal payments. And now let's um, assign uh, these inputs to the timeline. So here we can see when the grace period for principal payments is over 12 months we start uh, principal payments if this uh, period is equal to three months three months then we start payments if this period is zero we start payments right on the first month
the next our step is uh, calculating uh, the amount of depth uh, at each moment of the launch arm So here we have calculated the amount of depth for each moment in uh, long. Uh, long. Mm -hmm. And now it's time to calculate the interest payments at each month.
So now I have created the block for the loan. So this is the moment where we get the loan. This is an inflow. This is the principal payments. This is an expense. This is an expense. We mark it with red, and this is interest payments. This is also an expense. We mark it with red. And this line will go to cash flow statement, and these both lines will also go to cash flow, cash flow statement. Um, so, for example, if we um, decrease the amount of loan, if we have, for example, no grace periods or interest and principal payments, we will. Uh, see how the payment displays to the left or for example if we have some uh, base periods for principal payments and interest payments we we'll also see how the data is changing and now everything is ready for creation of creation of a cash flow statement and this will be the topic of our next video um, if you see that this video is useful for you, please give us a like, subscribe our channel. Also, you can order financial model from scratch for your business idea. See you next videos. And